Hello friends, in this video I would like to show you the complete process of installing the UniTheme step by step. We will install the latest version 4.12.1c today. The process itself is quite easy and consists of several steps. Before we get started, let's take a look at our store in its initial state, which we have before the installation. The default responsive theme is activated here. Now let's go down to the process. To start with, let's go to My Account, Orders, and click to the Go to the installation of the add-ons. Here we will need to download the add-ons manager. It's a service add-on that the other add-ons wouldn't work without. On the Managers page, you can also see all your add-ons, which are available for you, which are installed, and which have the updates available. Now let's go to the admin area and install this add-on in the standard for the CS card way. Let's go to Add-ons, Manage Add-ons and click the plus icon. Select the archive with the add-on and upload it. Done! You can now start installing the theme add-on and all the others in the package. To get to the Add-ons Manager page, open Add-ons, Manage Add-ons and select Alex Branding. Here we'll need to install all the available add-ons from the theme package one by one. It's important to wait until each add-on is installed, which will be completed by reloading the page and changing its status. I would also like to draw your attention to the fact that for the multi-vendor version of CS Card for UniTheme, you also need to install the corresponding add-on with the same name. It will be available in your add-ons manager, of course. Done. Now let's install the theme itself. Let's go to Design, Themes and select UniTheme2 on the View All Available Themes tab. The theme is installed. Let's apply it. On the Installed Themes tab, select one of the styles provided and agree to the changes. This is recommended for the proper functioning of your theme. You can then change the style at any time and also customize it for your needs. Now let's perform the last step. Let's add the demo data. These are the preformed blocks with the various content that will be added to the layout for you to get acquainted with the add-on and its capabilities. Let's start with adding the demo data for the theme itself. Let's go to Add-ons, Manage Add-ons, Alex Branding and here, next to the theme add-on, select the demo data menu item. As you can see, it's possible to add banners, menu with icons and block and immediately place them in appropriate blocks. Let's do it. Now let's return to the add-ons manager and repeat the same procedure for the rest of the add-ons, which there is a demo data available for.
Now after all the operations are done quickly and easily, we get a working theme with all the necessary functionality. Let's go to the front end and check the result. If you have any questions, you can always refer to our documentation, where you can find the detailed description of this process, as well as everything about its functionality and features. That's it guys for this video, subscribe to our channel and all the social medias to be notified about all the updates and new releases from Alex Branding team.